become the exciting person. Exciting people are coming to an end. People aren't excited to do things anymore. People aren't excited to go outside and have fun with their friends. Are you excited to go outside? Are you excited to see friends? Are you excited to see your family? Most people these days are glued on their phone. You know this. Everyone knows this. You probably are glued on the phone. Sometimes I get glued on my phone too doing stuff that I shouldn't. But like, what do you guys think about that? People are not exciting anymore. People aren't excited to have a day off. People aren't excited to see family members anymore. People don't even want to see their family. You could, you could have the greatest grandpa, grandma, mom ever. And you don't care anymore. I don't know what it is about phones, but they do that. If you want to be an exciting person, you need to go out and see people. Let them know that you are fun to be around. Let them know that phones aren't the only option to like, have enjoyment in life. People are forgetting what life is. Life is made to be enjoyed. And going on your phone constantly, how is that going to be enjoyable in the future? Is that not common sense? Your grandsons, are they going to be excited to do anything? Or are they just going to be on their phone? Are you going to let your kids, your kids, not your grandson, are you going to let your kids go on their phones? Now, I should rephrase that. Are you, are you, are you, are you going to let your kids go on their phones for more than five hours a day? Are you going to set a time limit? Because I know I will. If I ever had kids, I will set a time limit on their phone. My parents never thought about that because they didn't know about this. But now that I know about phones and everything, I will definitely. I know it's kind of hypocritical because back then, my time, like when I was 12, I was playing games all day. But you don't want your kids to be like what you mistake, you know? Like, yes, it's pretty hypocritical, but it's actually a good thing. Like, it's not a bad thing to be a hypocrite sometimes. Like, it's, it make, everyone makes it sound like being a hypocrite's bad, but sometimes it's a good thing. Being the exciting person, you just need to be an enjoyable person to be exciting. That's all you gotta do. Try to fit in, but not in a way that's bad, you know? Like, don't fit in and drink with people. Don't do that. Like, not, not, not that type of fitting in. I mean, like, fit in with their, like, humor, you know what I mean? That is being an exciting person. But you also need to be excited for your life. Can you do that? Ask yourself that. That's all I got for this video. You need to be an exciting person. You need to have an exciting days. And you need to have exciting days. That's all I got. Have a good day, guys. I want you to be more excited now. Think about it. Be more excited. That's all I got. See ya.